hey guys welcome back to data with dominic and in this video in the power query editor series we're going to be looking at how to use the count distinct values transformation in the power query editor so let's dive right into the demo as you can see i've got some uh, mocks or sample data in here which pertains to an e-commerce company and i've got their orders table loaded up in the power query editor so as you can see we have a lot of columns so the specific column that i want to work on for this one is the employee id column because as you can see the employee id repeats that means there are a few employees who have been taking all the orders for this particular company so just to be clear if you want to know how many rows are in this particular table you can hit the count rows and as soon as we hit the count rows we can see that there are 830 rows but as you can see in this employee id column we can see that all there's a lot of repeat of employees and stuff so if you want to find the number of distinct employees we can use this count distinct values or transformation and how we do that is we hit the transform tab after selecting the column for which we want to count distinct hit the transform come over to this number column section into the statistics and then we hit count distinct values so as soon as we hit count distinct values you can see that we have only nine unique employees and the numbers one to nine are probably being repeated throughout the 830 rows in this particular table so that's it for this video thank you guys for watching don't forget to like subscribe share comment and hit the bell icon and i'll see you guys in the next one